So who is this course designed for? Well, really what it comes down to is this course has been designed, quite frankly, for just about everyone. Now, don't take that too literally. Uh, every single person in the world isn't necessarily cut out to be a network administrator. But if somebody has their eyes set on being a network administrator, being an IT professional, well, really this course is for you. I created this with the idea that you can come in with very little to no knowledge and I'm going to give you what you need. So what are the prerequisites for the course? Well, as I've mentioned before, I designed this course with the idea that it was for pretty much anybody and everybody who has an interest in becoming a networking professional. Okay, so the main prerequisite that I'm going to tell you that you must have is you must have that desire to work with computer networks. This must be something that you genuinely want to have and you must have the prerequisite willingness to work hard because although I'm going to do my best to make this easy for you to understand, as any professional, you need to work hard at really knowing what it's all about and knowing what you're doing. So what is the value of the CompTIA Network Plus certification? Well, I'll tell you, CompTIA is a vendor neutral organization and, and that's very important to understand is there's a lot of certifications out there by specific vendors. Okay, Microsoft has certifications, Cisco has certifications, but CompTIA is vendor neutral, which means saying that you're Network Plus certified just means that you have a general understanding of how networks work without having to be specific to an individual vendor. Now, very often, people will look at these CompTIA certifications, especially something like Network Plus, as kind of that entry level certification get your foot in the door type in, you know, certification that you want to start with. And then from there, depending on where you want to put your focuses, you then move to a vendor specific certification track. So how much of the exam is actually covered? Uh, that's a very important question because when it comes to our CompTIA Network Plus certification courses, because, well, first of all, the certification is in the name of the title. And we also know that much of the audience is looking to get certified, one thing that I really focused on when creating the course was to make sure that we had 100% certification exam coverage. Now, with that said, I will also make sure that it's clear that CompTIA updates the exam periodically. For instance, there was a 2009 version of the Network Plus exam and we had a 2009 version of the course. They then updated it to the 2012 version of the exam. We created a 2012 version of the course. Now I will tell you there's not a whole lot of difference between the two exams. I mean networking hasn't changed that dramatically over the past few years. But one thing that we did change with our course is we've incorporated all sorts of new training techniques that I think you're really going to like.